Hi, TK Squad. Hi, TK Squad. Hi, TK Squad. <laughs> Guys, another day, another appointment. Yes. So we uh, are yeah. off to the hospital to check on Rainbow again. Yeah. So this is one week later. TK Squad, please. <laughs> The news that we are expecting today is to tell us that baby boy has engaged. That's the only thing I want to hear today. Yeah. Everything else, I'm sure everything is fine, but I want to be told that he's engaged because <laughs> I don't know anything else to expect at this appointment. So this is my 38 week appointment. Yeah. I don't know what else to expect. Hopefully it's just routine as well. <sighs> Hopefully Sorry. it's just routine But yeah, let's go and um, find out And as you can also see guys I took out my hair yeah. Tia helped me She also took out hers Well, she's got a hoodie on so you can't see Once we are done with the appointment We're going to go to this Indian shop To buy our hair products Some Shampoo, conditioner Because we don't have none of that All of that finished Because of that madam over there Yeah she overuses products, you guys. Overwashes her hair, all of that jolly jolly stuff. Tia's gonna wash my hair and I'll do the same for her. And you guys, I changed my hair because obviously it was not looking good anymore. Plus, I wanted to get something for the hospital because now, literally, I have I think two weeks left, which is nerve wracking. So, I wanted to get a new hairstyle for baby boy. Go to the hospital when. I'm looking good and Tia as well because has was in for like three months. So anyway, we've arrived. We've arrived. So we'll catch we'll you guys go. later because we are running late as always. Nothing the really hint up. was we started in the car. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Okay, we'll bye, catch you. Bye. Later. Yeah. Hey, Tia and guys. Hello again. <laughs> Hi, guys. It's here. Yes. Happy to see you. Tia, guys. you've got your seatbelt on, yeah? Yeah. Okay, do you want to deliver the good news about your brother? He's engaged. Yeah. <laughs> That's just brilliant. Not like yes. in the Mary way, really. <laughs> <laughs> Head down, ready to rock and roll. Yes, TK Squad. We're so excited. We didn't even bother to get home because usually we get home first to update you guys. Pinker. Yeah. There's but, two pink cars. Oh okay, my gosh, you got you, babe. Cars. How did you miss them? Mine. Okay. So you guys, baby boy is engaged. Okay. Yes. He He's engaged. And we heard his heartbeat again. We had his heartbeat again. She said everything's fine. Everything is good. Everything's normal. But she did take a while to find his heartbeat, which yeah. was a bit like yeah, what's know. happening. No, she said she already found it. She was just making like trying to make it yeah, make it louder. Yeah, but we couldn't said. hear it. Whereas before, we hear it the minute the thing is put on my stomach. But anyway, you guys, baby boy is engaged. Let's pray that he stays engaged because you know the second born, third born babies they can slip out. They yeah. can slip out. Apparently, it's not like the first one. The first one gets engaged and that's it. But the second born babies can sleep in and out, in and out. Yeah. But he's engaged. And the lady told me that my stomach, my bump is all baby. All baby. All which baby, is which is well. amazing. So I don't think I have like excess what water or anything else. Anything else that's yeah. So hopefully once I give birth, what? wrap my stomach. Yeah. Hopefully it won't take me long for it to go back down to its normal size. But yeah, you guys were so excited. So right now we're going into the city center. Well, we're going to get fuel first because we're running on vapour. Oh, yeah. yeah. And then, then, well, we're heading in anyway. They're at the bottom of Stocky Hall Street, so. Also, you guys, we've been given the option of going back either next week or in two weeks' time to get a membrane sweep. Yeah. That's the first time anybody's mentioned that to us, so we're a bit sure about that, aren't we? Yes. I kind of had an idea about what a membrane sweep is, especially, like, you know, from the apps as well. I never got it with Tia, so I had completely forgot about it. Yeah, we'll have to think about that, yeah. I did read on the app about it, so I kind of had a rough idea. So the midwife, she, actually, she's part of my midwife team. Yeah, she is. She's very nice. Today. Yeah, oh, she's so lovely. She's we a, love her. We last the, seen her when we were, what, 22 weeks, I think? Yeah, it's only, I think it's only the second time that we've actually seen her, but 
Yeah, but she's part of the team. It's because the main midwife, my main midwife, she's on holiday. So we got to see her again. Yeah. And she's given us the option if we want to get a membrane sweep. And if we don't want to get a membrane sweep, then we'll just, we just go back yeah. normal. TK Squad, let us know. Did you ever get a membrane sweep? Um, obviously, for those that have been pregnant, or did you just let everything play out naturally? Yeah. Um, we need to do that kind of quickly because we need to make our mind up. Yeah, on that, we need we? to make our mind up on that. It's basically to jump start labor. Yeah. She did say that in some women, if already your body is getting ready for labor, it can help. And then some, it doesn't really do anything. But it does cause discomfort yeah. and you can experience cramps, painful cramps. Yeah. And then nothing happens. So I'm a bit scared because I don't want to go through it only to experience these cramps yeah. for nothing yeah. or, or to just, just wait leave for it to happen yeah naturally. just leave it play naturally yeah. i didn't have tia until i was about 42 weeks pregnant i was 2 weeks late from my due date so i have a feeling it might be the same case for baby boy as well because there's no sign of him coming do you know what i mean uh, and we've only it. got 2 weeks left so well, yeah but We'll Other than that, that, we're just happy. But do let us know in the comments section because we, we do really need to make a, a decision fast. Let's go get some hair products, guys. Yeah. So we can fix our natural hair. I want to get my hair done before this boy comes. So before we even go for membrane sweeps, right. I need okay. to do my hair because I want to look good. I want my boy to come out and look at me and say, Oh, uh -huh. my mama is beautiful. Uh, no, well. oh, what the hell well. is that on her head? <laughs> 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 not that my hair is ugly no it's not but it is dirty and it needs a wash um but yeah tk squad i'm i'm so happy and when i'm happy i intend to blah 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 so let's go get petrol yeah you like to blah 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 i love you tia love you what did you think of the appointment i think it was anything good. left honey she can you see it can no yeah, you can go, 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 go. Can go on. Yeah. Yeah, Tia. Tia asked a lot of questions. So I, I know. Which was really good. I know. Usually she's quiet, yeah, but yeah, but she was asking really a lot of asked questions. Asked questions. Right? Yeah. So go on. I think it was really good. She was very, she was very like welcoming. She wanted us to feel comfortable, even though like some of the stuff she said were a bit disturbing. But you, know, you, have, to, <laughs> you have to go through it, even though you're pregnant. I know. Jeez. Uh, I know. Some some information Tia was a bit like, wait, what? What do they have to do to your vagina? <laughs> <laughs> Somebody has to do what? <laughs> but TK Squad, um, the other thing I'm actually happy about that we take Tia to these appointments is because they're actually learning this at school and they have watched videos of women giving birth. Yeah. So I feel like now Which she's is more having. Than I know she's having a um, educational. Moment. Yeah, it's That's educational. A... No, she's actually living it live. Do you know what I mean? Aye. You can't. She can't make up her mind. No, but it's beginning. Oh, come on, Tia. Edge style, an edge. Edge. I think they're at the top there. I, that... I don't think so. I'm looking for just olive oil products. All right. That's what I put in my hair. All right. I know some of you keep asking me, Keke, your hair is long. What do you do? I'll show you some products when we get home. Okay. So far, this is what we've got. So we went to the hair salon, not not the hair salon, the hair shop, yeah. and I picked up some products. So I was trying to show you, yeah, NT as well, but then my battery on my phone died, you guys. So sorry about that. And we left the actual camera in the car. So we got our products. I'll show you when I get home. So now we're heading to Tesco to do some shopping for the house, grab some food because we don't have anything. What do we need here? TK Squad, every time we come to do grocery shopping, 
we always forget to pull the camera up. <laughs> Look at the haul we've got so far, you're right. We remembered what we've already filled the cart up, <laughs> but we still have more to get. Yeah, starting with what? Um, washing powder. Yeah. So, fairy. You only eat fairy, we only eat fairy. <laughs> Pardon? We only eat fairy. Right, see that one there? Yeah. The, on the, the, I could get a better deal than that in the one further back, yeah. Oh no, no, no. Very as well. Oh no, 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 that's good. That's about £10.50. Yeah, that's very good actually, yeah. We just don't have space. By the way, why are you pushing the trolley? Because you asked to, because you're holding on to it. I'm holding on to uh, it. In case yes, people it's not heavy because I'm just dragging like, it. And Tia's been on the phone to her pal for what, the last two hours? This is how sometimes she's not in the videos because she's always on the phone for some of you guys who actually say Oh, but Tia is never in the videos. <laughs> That's why. Yeah, and usually in our room. Are you trying to make space? I'll just put it on top there, darling. Don't worry. Right, we'll come back to you once we've done a bit more, yeah? Okay. I'll just leave it on there, okay? Just put it there. Create a dog space there. There we go. Right. So we need to go back and get my hospital snacks. snacks. And so are you going to get some energy drinks? Some energy drinks. You some you like chocolates. All right, okay. <laughs> yeah. Right, we've got quite a haul here. Right, right, we'll go back this way, shall we? Come on then. What do you mean? Um, well, what I was going to suggest, get some resealable bags if you can. So that if you can't finish them, you just reseal the bag and you put them in your locker. Some of the stuff. My locker? <laughs> well, you'll have a bedside locker. I would imagine you'll have that. A bedside table. Bedside, a bedside table. Bedside locker. <laughs> I'm not so sure about it. Oh, God. So it was oh, suddenly, always mom who loved m and bags. Suddenly you're interested because we're now in the sweetie section, yes. That is not true. Uh, I just thought I should be in the video uh, because this <laughs> is a family I'll talk to your friends. Anyways, love y'all. Okay. So she's still on the phone and she's disturbing us. Babe, what should I get? I oh, definitely babes. want Maltesers. Right, okay, stick them in. I'm gonna oh. go for the big pack. Yeah, go for the big pack. Just a couple of those, darling. Like, these are my favourite, but I like the white Maltesers. Alright. Yeah. I don't know if they've got those, to be honest. No, I'll just take one. Right, what we're else? also not trying to gain weight. Right, okay. <laughs> and also because if you're another couple of weeks, they'll be long gone. Yeah. <laughs> no, you lot are not going to eat my stuff. It's done wrong. <laughs> we'll see when Tia gets a hold you of that. You ate my Easter egg. <laughs> What have you got there? Galaxy. Do you like that? Yeah. Okay, take that then. Here's larger packs here, look. Oh, I don't like Galaxy, I must admit, it's not my favourite. But anyway, it's up to you. Guys, the whole point why I'm taking chocolate is because I've not had chocolate in nine freaking months. I need to start taking all my sweet goodies, feed my sweet tooth. God, the trolley is so full, our stuff are falling over. <laughs> I thought about getting a deeper one, I should have as well. <laughs> I mean, even the lift 
might it might be too heavy for the lift. Guys, imagine. We filled the trolley up to the to the beam. Uh, to the brim and beyond. And this is a bit. To the beam, to the brim. Brim, B-R-I-M. Oh, brim. Oh. Yeah, the car is packed nice and close. So we don't have to go so far away. Babe, give me the actual camera. Let me record with the actual camera. Wait, you were struggling to open the boot. We'll wait all night for you to open that, Graham. No, you won't. Just Tia, you were struggling a minute ago. No, if I'm only I, I called you. They did not see it. There was no proof of it. <laughs> Are you not helping Graham put oh, stuff in the car? I okay. I thought you were going to sit down for a no, minute there. I want you to put my bag away. Now. Push no. the trolley closer to the car. <laughs> Guys, we have a story about that. We'll let you know when we get home. <laughs> uh, Tia, you should be handling him like the heavy stuff first. I really need the heavy stuff the first. The bigger to stuff. Honest, right? here, here. Don't rush him. You can also take it to the car. You don't need to pass it to him. Just carry stuff in the boot. Really? You're just gonna carry like one little pack of chicken? That was the first thing I saw. <laughs> of all things. Exactly, that's what she's doing. That's not what I'm doing. Not really these <laughs> We've had a very eventful day. We're half of this. What time? It's almost 7.30. No, no. We've spent the entire day. Well, not really the entire day, half of the day out and about. Guys, if you hurry up, we'll be able to see outside and catch some sun. Oh, that would be brilliant, man. Sun yeah, away in some. Scotland, sun. Right, I'm going to get my pound back as well. <laughs> From the trolley. Yeah. <laughs> Tia in the house. So what were you, what were you saying to you? So how, how would mum thank me? So the way mum would thank Graham would be like, Oh, thanks, babe. Oh, thank you, babe. How would you thank mum? I would be like, thanks, mum. How would you thank Graham? Thank you, Graham. This is how Graham thanks mum. Darling, thank you, babes. Thank you, babes, darling. Babe. I'm so thankful. Thank you, babes. <laughs> Oh, darling, like he shouldn't acts, have. He puts an accent in every single speech he makes. <laughs> Seriously. So when he's happy, he's like, Are you serious, mate? Oh, my God. Oh, that's true. And then when he's angry, he's like, Oh, shut up. Shut up. He's silly. Yeah, no, hurry up. You can't hurry say up. That. Hurry up. And then when he's lovey dovey to mom, he's like, Oh, thanks, babe. <laughs> <laughs> See how I'm abused in this relationship, TK squad. This abused is not abuse. This is reality. <laughs> but, anyway. that, but that's true is because I'm always like, thanks, babe. You are. Oh, that's right. She's, she's got that dirty. Yeah. TK squad. This is us back home. So, guys, I wanted to show you this. I've started drinking this tea. I saw it on Instagram. Hot Tia Mama, the final push, caffeine free organic herbal infusion with raspberry leaf and peppermint. So many reviews of women saying that it helped them jumpstart labor and it's recommended when pregnant only drink from 32 weeks onwards. So I'm currently 38 weeks. So I started drinking it yesterday and I will see some women it has helped some women nothing or it has made labor a bit easier some women say i don't know how true it is but raspberry tea is an old wife's tale so i've started doing everything that i can to jump start labor basically kind of naturally i only drank one tea bag yesterday i'm gonna drink another one today and then also i'm eating pineapple 
like no man's business. Guys, why are you not bringing stuff in? Oh, that's why you're going to call them. No, no. Bring stuff in. Guys, we literally just got home. So these guys are bringing in the groceries. Now, for those that are always in the comment section, <laughs> your hair is so long. What do you do? What do you do? What do you do? Guys, I literally do not do much with my hair, right? You know the saying of everything is, uh, too much of everything is bad for you? That is true. Too much of everything is bad for you, right? So if you're putting too much product in your hair, of course, as time goes on, it becomes too much to the point that your scalp is not breathing, your scalp, like you're not giving it a chance to, I don't know, do what you do to help your hair grow. I don't know. Is it maybe genetics? It might be my mom had long hair. My sisters, we all have long hair, but that's because they really don't do much with their hair in the sense of putting too much product. But also what I've also discovered when I used to handle Tia's um, hair care routine, her hair was pretty much the same length as mine until she cut it. And then obviously now that she's a teenager, she's she's constantly oiling it and all of that stuff so it's not growing it's something that i've told her to actually stop doing because it's not good for the hair so guys this is my natural hair i'll show you i took it out um, yesterday so it's not washed but this is my my natural hair i've cut it so many times in the past you guys and i grow it out and it always passes my sisters <laughs> but this is my natural hair i've got a lot of um, growth so it needs to be washed hence why we went and bought this product because everything finished in the past i've used the sheer butter range cantu range and also i relax my hair once a year that's it once a year just to give it some soft Softness, I don't know, but anyway, so the products that really work with my hair are olive oil products. So I got the shampoo, olive oil shampoo, okay, and then I got the conditioner. So this one is the actually. That's the other thing I forgot. I should have got a leave-in conditioner. I got this conditioner. I've never tried this one, but I looked at it ready and I thought I'll try this one. So that one. Oh yeah, and Tia painted my nails. She's learning. And then I got a deep treatment conditioner as well. Okay. So guys, when I braid my hair, take it out, I always wash it, condition it, and then do a deep treatment okay and then also with this one i've used a uh, do grow make a thick formula hair oil for years so this is what i always use for my braids because um it helps my hair grow it helps with uh itchy scalp it helps with dandruff and i love the fact that like this so it's easy for braids it's quicker I don't need help from anybody. I can oil my own hair. And then this is what Tia got for herself. Mealy rosemary mint scalp and hair straightening oil. She's always on TikTok finding stuff. So she got this for herself. And then she's into like learning how to do baby hairs, which I really do not bother. So she got herself some age control. I'm not allowing her to use gel on her hair. This one is also a hair gel, but it's not too rough as the Eco Styler gel because you constantly need to wash that out. And then she just bought this little gel brush to be able to slick her baby hair. So that's pretty much it, you guys. Don't use too much product on your hair. I always braid my hair, take it out, leave my scalp to breathe. And then after like a month or two, do braids again, that kind of a thing, do whatever style I want to do. So in a year, I plait my hair twice and also 
have like a, a month or two months of a break from um, plating my hair the other thing also that I do and I did for Tia and that's exactly what I'm gonna do for baby is making sure that when before I go into labor do my hair plate my plait my hair and then also still have it for a few weeks or maybe two weeks after baby if I do take it out I'll plait it again and then that also helps with like I don't get hair loss I never lose my hair postpartum hair loss like I, I, I've never experienced that she a queen so yeah you guys these guys are here putting the grocery away but that's what I wanted to um come on and uh, tell you guys but other than that we're back home and I think we're just gonna say good night to you guys because we're just gonna put all this stuff away and relax for the rest of the evening. We're we saying good night because Graham is working tomorrow, so yeah. And we need to watch House of Dragon, babe. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, right. Absolutely. So we're night. we need to kick Tia to the curve to right. her room so you we can watch her. House of Dragon. I don't need that. I'm the one kicks right. That's your stuff. Please take it. Yeah, my Miley. Yeah. Right, say goodnight then. Alright, TK Squad, we love you. Love good you night. guys. Good night, guys. Good night. God bless. Wait, wait, wait. <sighs> TK Squad. Rainbow needs to say bye bye too. Hold on. Hold yeah, on. But the awkward silence will be so fun. <sighs> say bye bye. Oh. Bye bye. <laughs> see you later, no. TK Squad. Bye, <laughs> 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 bye guys. Bye, everyone. Bye. <laughs>